Hello, this is Dagogo Gamer, and welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 2. Uh, so, uh, last time we started uh, Planet Colis, a pretty crappy planet, um, and we're looking for a Krogan Warlord. I think this is, yeah, this is the way we're supposed to go. Okay, so I think we still have a bunch of enemies to fight through, but we should be getting fairly close to the Krogan Warlord. Let's bypass this door here. You know, I was I, earlier, like actually yesterday, I was playing uh, Mass Effect Three, and bypassing doors in that game is so much better. You uh, just kind of press A, and then he like sits there for a while with his Omni tool opening it, and then it opens. You don't have to do that weird puzzle thing that I just did. But the reason why I was playing Mass Effect Three yesterday is uh, wait. Uh, is as I was playing the Leviathan DLC that just came out, um, which is pretty sweet. Hey, look, a sniper rifle. I'll take it. Research data, but yeah, uh, Leviath the Leviathan DLC was pretty cool. Don't I mean you you if you're into Mass Effect and you have that game, you definitely need to play it. Don't be fooled by the fact that the first DLC, the Javik one, was really lame in day one and all. Leviathan is worth it. It's probably the best Mass Effect DLC I've played. I mean, well, I don't know. There are some other really good ones, but Leviathan is just... Oh my god, I played that straight through from start to finish. I didn't stop once. It was so amazing. I still have this stupid three-round burst gun. Once I go back to the Normandy, I need to go to the Armory and change this, because I don't like the three-round burst thing. Okay. It's been a while since I've played this, so I don't quite remember, but I think we're getting fairly close. A lot of Turians here. Oh god. Oh god. Getting shot at. Oh god, they're, they're close. Take out all these guys. It's telling me I should use an ammo power. Screw you, I ain't using no ammo power. I I I will take care of these guys the old fashioned way. Except this never ammo powers never were the old fashioned or never were the new way. They kinda were the old fashioned way. Okay, do I really want to hack this PDA? Eh, I don't like the code stuff, but okay. Uh let's see. What ones can I find? I don't see what I'm looking for. Oh wait, there it is. Okay, now uh, one with a really short blue line and a lot of orange. This one. Okay, now blue thing in the middle. Oh god, I'm running out of time. No, wait, no, it wasn't that one. It was this one. Oh, barely made it. Okay, so what's on this PDA? Credits. Cool. All right, let's open this door now. This is re is this the research lab? No. Med kit though. Oh god, getting shot at. Oh god. Nice shot. At least this three round burst gun takes out most of these guys in one or two uh one or two uh, pulls of the trigger. But still I don't like the three round burst thing. Oh god. Okay, one left. I mean, two left, I think. Here, I'm... I, I feel like these guys should be pretty easy to take out if I charge them with a shotgun. So let's switch to... Katana shotgun. So I have a katana now. I can be all like, Banzai! With my katana. Oh god. Oh jeez. Charging wasn't a good idea. Shoot this why can't I shoot that guy? Okay, this shot this shotgun plan isn't going very well. I'm taking a lot of damage. Let's hide over here. Oh god, don't kill me. I like life. Especially because it means I don't have to go back to whatever the last uh, save point was. 
Okay, but let's go. Jeez, they really are they really don't like us being in here. Okay, those guys are kind of far away, so I think I'm going to pull out my sniper. Let's try to take out the guys at the back. God, I can't wait until I get the gun in this game that doesn't make you have to uh, reload every shot. There's one that lets you reload every, like, five shots. You gotta take out that guy there before his shields recharge. There we go. Okay, that's most of them. Where are the rest? I think that's all of them. Okay, wall safe. Credits. Let's see. Power cells over here. Those are useful. Uh, th we're probably supposed to go in that door over there now. Concentrate on ah! Someone just got shot. Concentrate on ah! I don't think there's a guy named ah. <laughs> That's funny. The guy's like, there are three of them! Three! And you're, you know, there's like hundreds of you and you're being defeated. But, you know, that's kind of how unrealistic video games are. Three guys taking out hundreds of guys. You, if you've ever played Uncharted, that game is even more ridiculous. Because you just play as Nathan Drake. And sometimes you have one other person with you. Or maybe, maybe like, I think the most I've ever seen is three other people. But usually it's just you. Just one guy, and you're mowing down, like, hundreds of heavily armed soldiers, and you're just a dude. Which is kind of unrealistic, but it's an awesome game. Just like this game, this game's awesome, too. My, my shields are down. And now they are back up, and fully recharged. And these guys are kind of difficult. Come on, just, just die. Oh god, that's a rocket. Oh god, I almost got hit by that. Oh god. Okay, I think that's all of them. Let's uh, move on! Oh god, that was pretty bad. I got shot like a bunch there. Well, that was weird. What, what just happened there? Uh, don't kill me. I like life, but you don't. Well, you probably do, but I won't let you have that. And this guy just died sitting up. So many guys. You know, I think after this mission, I might do Kasumi's uh, DLC on, mission, because that one is fairly, uh, it, I don't know. Well, at least the beginning of it is quite calm. Get, a, get away from all this fighting nonsense. Well, I guess recently we did the Normandy crash site uh, mission, which didn't have any fighting at all, so we should be, you know, all ready to fight now, but this mission is pretty intense. <laughs> Melee, melee, melee. I don't know why I always randomly melee like that. It's just fun. Meleeing is fun. Shepherd, don't shoot. Wait, is this a Krogan? What's the Krogan doing here? Don't shoot. Do I know you? I shut down the security cams as soon as I saw it was you. Never thought I'd say it, but I'm glad it's you shooting up the place. Sorry, ran a phenoptis. You let me go when you destroyed Saren's lab on Vermeer? Had to outrun a nuke in a utility pod, but it's still a second chance. Oh, it's this lady. I assume you have a good reason for being at this lab. Don't worry, I'm not wasting the chance you gave me. My work here, strictly better. Right. Not for the mercs. Jador's on a standard power trip. But Okir is trying to do something good, even if his methods are a little extreme. Doesn't look Everyone good to me. Second chance, right? 
And sometimes giving one pays off. I take care of my debts. What's Okir trying to do here? It's complicated. Jadora wants a private army, but Okir mostly ignores her. He's running the project for his own reasons. I created a mental imprint routine to educate his tank bread. Most don't get through it. He dumps me for some reason. He wants to help his people, but he's not looking for a genophage cure, and he's not going for numbers. That's all I know. Finding you in a place like this makes me think letting you go was a mistake. You don't want that. We agree on that. Don't worry. I plan on staying as far away from anything to do with you as possible. Now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna run like hell before you blow the place or something. I know... <laughs> Second chances. I'm not so sure on third ones. Well, that was another instance of something that seems like a paragon or a renegade action, but was actually paragon. But oh, let's attempt to hack this. Uh, this one and this one and this one, and I need another. Uh, This one? No? Dang it. Um, crap. Crap. Give me code. Ugh. Um, now I need this one. Ha! Credits. Cool, more credits. Credits are nice. Pretty much just use them for fuel, but, you know. Here you are. I've watched Warlord Orc here. On these tanks will not wait while you play with these idiotic mercs. I take it you're okay here. You don't seem particularly caged or grateful that I'm here. You may claim to be here to help, but the formerly deceased shepherd is not a sign of gentle change. Surprised, old Krogan should know you. I'm sure Rana has already revisited your actions on Vermeer. Rana, who's Rana? I didn't have a lot of room for finesse. If there'd been any other solution, I'd have considered it. But I approve. Saren's pale horde were not true Krogan. Numbers are known on nothing. The mistake of an outsider, one that these mercenaries have also made. I gave their leader my rejects for her army, but she grows impatient. It's time for you to take me out of here. We hear about the collectors. We couldn't care less about your problems. I see. Yes. Collector attacks have increased. A human concern. My requests were focused elsewhere. I acquired the knowledge to create one pure soldier. With that, I will inflict upon the genophage the greatest insult an enemy can suffer. To be ignored. Methods are extreme, but you know how to deconstruct a threat. Will you help us? Perhaps I can strike a deal to secure passage, but my prototype is not negotiable. It is the key to my legacy. with a damn valve. Shepard, you want information on the collectors? Stop her. She'll try to access contaminants in the storage bay. You can just start over like she plans to. What's the big deal? This tank is pure. It involved as much trial as data. Starting over will not duplicate it. It must survive. Jador will be with the rejected tanks. Kill her. I will. Stay. And do what must be done. Okay, so we have to fight this lady who is uh, on a power trip for stuff and stop the gas from coming into this room. Uh, okay, so where is she? Probably down here. 
You cannot kill that Krogan. That Krogan is my friend. I guess. You'll poison them all. Oh god. Oh god, she's heavily shielded. And so are her, uh, Krogan Berserkers. Oh god, my shields. No. Okay, you're you're getting annoying. Oh god, my health. My health. Oh god, my health. Don't kill me. This is not good. I don't have any cover. Oh god, that is a that is a heavy mech. Good thing my shields recharged just then or I would have been screwed. Okay, let's do sniper. Actually, no. We'll do the grenade launcher to take out that mech. And to take out that mech, we'll also use a concussive shot. This should take it out quickly. Yes! Haha! -ha. Might want to even... Oh god, there's a Krogan there. Shotgun! Thank you, Garrus. I think Garrus helped me out with that. Okay, I could use my rocket launch, my grenade launcher on uh, that lady to try to take her out quickly, but she's kind of far away. Let's see. Sniper. We'll do a sniper. Sniper's fairly effective. Oh, she's almost down. And she's down. Oh god, that's a Krogan right there. Okay. Okay, something bad happened. But we took out that lady, so... Sacrificed himself to save this dude. His soldier prototype. Why would someone so fanatical sacrifice himself for one Krogan? No telling what a kid jammed into this thing's head. Releasing it may not be wise. A pure Krogan could pack a hell of a punch. You can always use another heavy hitter. If he'll help, I doubt anyone's asked for his opinion. Normandy, Okir is a no-go, but we have a package that needs retrieving. And he's a big one. Cool. Now we shall return to the Normandy. And we wait for the frickin' long loading screen. Takes forever. There we go. Yeah, you've said that a few times now. A normal Krogan is dangerous. This one was created and likely educated by a madman. There's no way he's getting out unless one of us lets him out. Or unless Okir installed some sort of failsafe. Or a malfunction causes the tank to shut down. I'm not saying we take the crowbar to it right now, but I'm not giving up a potential resource. It's your decision, Commander. Just be careful. Noted. The cargo holds safe enough while I decide what to do with it. Okay, so... We have a choice to make. We can either let that Krogan out or leave him in there. But the Paragon action is to let him out and it will give us a uh, valuable ally. 
So we are going to let this Krogan dude out.